Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x power 6 is equal to x minus 4 brackets power 6. To find the values of x from this equation, now in the first step, we'll take this x minus 4 bracket power 6 into the left side. So it will be this, which is x power 6. This will take to this side to be minus bracket x minus 4 bracket power 6 is equal to 0. Then in the next step, from here in the left side, we'll make this in form of a perfect square. So x power 6 into square, it is x power 3 bracket square. Then minus x minus 4 bracket power 6 into square, it is x minus 4 bracket power 3, then bracket again power 2. Because power of 3 times 2 is power of 6 is equal to this 6. Now into here, this is in the form of a perfect square. So we'll apply a perfect square rule, which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. Then we'll apply this form of a plus b. It will be this inside the bracket plus this inside the bracket. So this which is x power 3 plus this which is x minus 4 bracket power 3 bracket then times a minus b. It will be this minus this. So it will be x power 3 minus bracket x minus 4 bracket power 3 bracket is equal to this 0. Then in the next step, from here we have two solutions. Whereas this is the first solution, which is x power 3 plus x minus 4 bracket power 3 is equal to 0. And this is the second solution, x power 3 minus x minus 4 bracket power 3 is equal to 0. Now, from this first solution, this power 3 plus this power 3, this is in the form of a perfect cube. So, we'll apply a perfect cube rule in this form, whereas this is in the form of a power 3 plus b power 3 is equal to a plus b bracket, then bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket. Then we'll apply this form. So it will be a plus b. It will be this plus this. So it will be x plus x minus 4 bracket. Then times a square. It will be x square. Then minus a times b. It will be x times this x minus 4. So here yeah, x bracket x minus 4 bracket. Then plus b square. It will be this square which is x minus 4 bracket square is equal to this 0. Then in the next step, from here x plus x is 2x minus 4 bracket. Then bracket this x square, negative x times x is negative x square. Negative x times negative 4 is positive 4x. Then plus the square of x minus 4, it will be x square, then minus x times 4 times 2 is 8x, then plus 4 square, it is 16, is equal to this 0. Then in the next step, from here, here bracket, it will be this, which is 2x minus 4, bracket, bracket, into here, we have this x square minus x square. This is 0. So this and this will cancel. So it will be this, which is x square. Then 4x minus 8x is minus 4x. Then plus this 16 bracket is equal to 0. Now from here we have two solutions. Whereas the first solution is this 2x minus 4 is equal to this 0 and the second solution is this quadratic equation which is x square minus 4x plus 
16 is equal to 0. Now, from this first solution here, we'll take negative 4 to the right side. So, it will be 2x is equal to 4. Then, we divide by 2 in both sides. So, this 2 and this 2 cancel. Then, it will be x is equal to 4 divided by 2 is 2. So, this is the first value of x in this our problem. Now, to solve from this quadratic equation here, we'll use quadratic formula. Now, from quadratic formula, to find the values of x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative b, it is this negative 4. Then plus or minus square root of b square, it will be this negative 4 bracket square. Then minus 4 times a is 1 times c is this 16 then over 2 times a a is 1 then it will be x is equal to negative and negative to be positive 4 plus or minus square root of negative 4 square it is positive 16 then it will be negative 4 times 16 4 times 6 is 24 goes to 4 times 1 is 4 plus 2 is 6. Then over this time this is 2. Then into here to be x is equal to 4 plus or minus square root of 16 minus 24 to be negative. Here to be 14. 14 minus 6 is 8. Here left with 5. 5 minus 1 is 4. So to be negative 48 over 2. Then from here, it will be x is equal to 4 plus or minus square root of negative 48. 48 is same as 16 times 3, then times this negative, negative 1, then over this 2. Then it will be x is equal to, it will be 4 plus or minus square root of 16 is 4 times this square root of 3 then times square root of negative 1 is i. Then we divide by 2 in both parts, in this part and in this part. So it will be x is equal to this divided by this divided by this is 2 plus or minus into here by 1, this by 2. So it will be 2 square root of 3 times i. So into here also we have two solutions because of plus or minus. Then to solve from this second solution here, we have this second solution here. We have this to the power of 3 minus this to the power of 3. Now this is in the form of a perfect cube. So we'll apply a perfect cube rule in this form, whereas this is in the form of a power of 3 minus b power of 3, which is equal to a minus b bracket bracket a square, then plus ab plus b square bracket then we'll apply this form so it will be a minus b it will be this x minus x minus 4 so x minus bracket x minus 4 bracket then bracket then times a square it will be this x square then plus a times b it will be this x times x minus 4 so your x bracket x minus 4 bracket then plus b square, it will be this square, which is x minus 4, then bracket square, bracket is equal to this 0. Then from here, we'll open the bracket by this negative. So it will be x, here it will be negative x, negative and negative to be positive 4, bracket, then bracket this x square, x times x, it will be plus x square x times negative 4 is negative 4 x then plus into here it will be x square then minus x times 4 times 2 it will be 8 x then 4 square it is 16 so it will be plus 16 bracket is equal to 0 then into here x minus x is 0, so this and this will cancel, so here it will be left with 4, then bracket, 
here x square plus x square plus x square is 3x square minus 4x minus 8x is minus 12x then this plus 16 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we'll divide by 4 in both sides so this and this will cancel then it will be this which is 3x square minus 12x plus 16 is equal to 0 divided by 4 it is 0 then from this quadratic equation here we'll solve to find the values of x we'll apply this quadratic formula like this one so it will be x is equal to negative b it will be negative b here it is this negative 12 bracket plus or minus square root of b square b square it will be this negative 12 square then minus 4 times a is this 3 then times c it is this 16 then over 2 times a a is 3 by using we use this quadratic formula here then it will be x is equal to negative and negative to be positive 12 plus or minus square root square root of negative 12 square is positive 144 then here it will be negative this 4 times 3 is 12 12 times 16 now from 12 60 is same as 16 times 12 so this time this is 2 then here it will be 3 then here 6 1 so it will be 2 9 1 192 so here it will be minus 192 then over this time this is 6 then it will be x is equal to 12 plus or minus square root of this minus this it will be negative here it will be 12 12 minus 4 is 8 here we'll be left with from 9 to 8 8 minus 4 is 4 then over this 6 then in the next step it will be x is equal to 12 plus or minus square root of negative 48 it will be 16 times 3 this is 48 then times this, this negative which is negative 1 then over this 6 then it will be x is equal to 12 plus or minus square root of 16 is 4 then times this square root of 3 square root of negative 1 is i then we divide by 6 in this part and in this part so into here it will be x is equal to 12 divided by 6 is 2 plus or minus to simplify here by 2 here by 3 so it will be 2 square root of 3i then over this 3 so from here also we have two solutions because of plus or minus therefore the conclusion from this our problem the first value of x is equal to this 2 the second value of x is equal to into here when it is positive to be 2 plus 2 square root of 3i so here 2 plus 2 square root of 3i the third value of x is equal to when it is negative to be 2 minus 2 square root of 3i so here 2 minus 2 square root of 3i the fourth value of x is equal to from here when it is positive to be 2 plus 2 square root of 3i over 3 so into here it will be 2 plus 2 square root of 3i over 3 and the fifth value of x is equal to is 2 minus 2 square root of 3i over 3 so into here it will be 2 minus 2 square root of 3i over 3 so these are all the we have five values of x into this our problem whereas this first value here it is a real solution and these other four values are complex solution now let's check if these solutions are correct we'll check for only this real solution
if it will, it will vary it will satisfy our equation so to check for x is equals to 2 into here into a problem we substitute 2 into here and here so it will be 2 power of 6 is it equal to 2 minus 4 then bracket power of 6 now it will be 2 power of 6 2 power of 6 is same as 2 power of 3 plus 2 power of 3 like 2 power of 6 this is 64 like 2 power of 3 times 2 power of 3 2 power of 3 is 8 times 2 power of 3 is 8 8 times 8 is 64 is it equal to this minus this to be negative 2 then bracket power of 6 now any any number which it can even if it, it is negative number power of even number it is positive number so to be 64 is equal to negative 2 power of 6 is still 64 now left side and right side are equal then it is true for the value of x is equal to 2 also the other complex solutions are correct thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye